on the shoulder of this officer and gives him a lesson that I want to share with you and I hope you will carry with you through your life. He tells him, Saab, har ek ki kismat mein, har ek ki zindagi mein, kuch misfire missile likhe hoi hai. Ye likha hoi hai ke kuch aapke missile misfire hoongi. Aapke dono misfire training mein khatam ho gaye, jang ke medan bilai. It's such an important lesson. Each time you are defeated, you fail to achieve an objective, you are not able to get what you want. Remember a little bit of bad luck, a little bit of bad bread is there in everybody's life. If that bad luck goes away in college, it goes away when the stakes are low, it goes away when, when nothing earth shattering is going to happen, then it's good that you have used up your bad luck. And I want to end this whole series of stories with this last one about Havaldar Nair again. Some years later, of course, I graduated from there and some years later, there was a massive competition happening in our division. And this competition was of field firing, all sorts of firing. Eventually, however, what happened was that two battalions, the 22nd Mechanized Infantry Regiment and the 1st Mechanized Infantry Regiment, these were the two who were in the pole position neck to neck. They were just neck to neck in pretty much every score. Finished to decide which one of these two would be the eventual winners, it was decided that we will do a sudden death. One tank will come from each battalion and they will both face off each other. They will fire towards the target. Whichever tank wins, that battalion wins. Whichever BMP, technically, whichever BMP wins, that. So I was selected from my uh, battalion to go and represent. And so this tank is coming, 22nd mech, fluttering flag, coming, rumbling in. And from the other side, there is another BMP coming in, which is from 1st mech. And both of us come and park ourselves in the rampart, get ready. And of course, we're going to fire our machine guns, we're going to fire our main guns. But the killer, which will actually tilt the score, is going to be the missile. Because the missile is the one that is given the highest score. So both the BMPs are lined up. They are both ready, and at that point of time, I look towards my left and I notice that there is a crew over there, obviously, the tank has a crew. So I decide that I'm just going to run across and wish this competitor of mine the best of luck. So I take off my headgear, I take off my radio, I get out of my tank, and I start jogging to the other tank. And when that crew sees me coming, they realize that I'm coming to say something to them. So he also opens the cupola, and the person emerges from the gunner's seat. And who do I see there? Havaldar Nair. So he's the instructor who taught me, against whom I'm going to be competing right now, in the next 30 seconds. And this is Paltan Ki Izzat Kazawal. My Paltan's Izzat, his Paltan's Izzat. Both of us are fighting for our battalion's honors. So I looked at Havaldar Nair and I told him, <coughs> I used to call him Ustad always. I said, Ustad, best of luck. So he said, same to you, sir. Then I said, Aas to Ustad aur Shagird ki takkar hogi. Today is a battle between the Ustad, the instructor, student. And then Havaldar Nair said something to me, which has a lot of gravitas. He said, sir, lekin cheat to meri hi hogi. I'm the one who is going to win anyway. And I said, how do you say that? How do you have so much of confidence? He said, sir, aisa hai ki agar main jeeta, to main jeeta. Agar aap jeete, to ustad jeeta. If you win, <laughs> if, you, if I win, then I win. And if you win, the instructor wins. And that day, Ustad Nair did win. The last lesson I want you to leave is the fact that leaders are supposed to produce leaders better than them. That is the job of leaders. So at every occasion, every time in your life, whenever you achieve something, remember that you have achieved that on the shoulders of leaders, of well-wishers, parents, friends, who have stood and allowed you to stand on their shoulders and reach the heights. And that is a responsibility that each one of us owes to our subordinates, our peers, and our juniors. Thank you very much. Jai Hind.